So today at Park School, we are bringing Folklore Urbano, which is an ensemble of musicians and dancers who will come in this afternoon to do a performance for our students. But it's not just a performance, so it's not just a passive and, um, experience for kids, it's an interactive experience where kids will hear about different music, uh, dances, they'll get to observe um, grown-ups participate in dances from different parts of Latin America and will also be asked to, to speak a little bit in Spanish. And so this year we brought for Color Urbano because we wanted to bring in a different um, relevant learning experience for kids. Not just because it's, we were celebrating Hispanic Heritage Month, but also because we want to make sure that every experience we bring to Park School has relevance. And students sort of see themselves not just in the books that they read, but also in the experiences that they have here at Park School. So um, we're looking forward to, to this afternoon's performance. Hey, I'm Anna Pavich de Mayor. I'm one of the directors of Cumbia for Kids, uh, the educational program of Folklore Urbano NYC. We're very excited to come to Ossining to celebrate Hispanic heritage with the music and dance traditions of the country of Colombia, um, where our musical and dance directors are from. Pablo Mayor, our composer from Cali, Colombia, and Daniel Fetecua, our dance director from Bogota, Colombia. We're um, always excited to share the rich traditions of Latin America, which uh, of Colombia, which you find all over Latin America, which involves the, uh, the mix of Native American, African, and Spanish cultures. And uh, we see this in the dance and in the instruments. Uh, today we took the kids on a journey through this incredibly diverse uh, country of Colombia, through the four major geographical regions, where we find these Spanish, African, and Native influences in different ways, shapes, and forms and we're excited to see the kids singing and teach them a little Espanol this, this afternoon um, and very happy to share with this really rich uh, cultural district of Austin. Thank you for having us. It was such a great performance. Um, the students were interactively engaged with the performers. Many of them went up to the stage and participated. There was a call and response where children were asked to translate certain words into Spanish. I think what really hooked them in was the active dancing. So the music was really loud and very um, energetic. And the students really like gravitated towards that. And really, you can see it in their faces. Some of them were standing up and dancing. Um, the performers also made sure not just, to, not just to talk about one particular country, although many of them were from Colombia, it, they really talked about the history of Latin America, the, the Americas really, from the time of slavery to the, the present. And through their storytelling, they were able to teach kids about where music comes from, how the different types of dances are uh, originated, and students got to see some of that. So it was wonderful to see how our students really enjoyed it, but also our teachers. Many of our teachers um, spoke about that. That assembly is uh, a highlight of their, of their day and something that they would like to see back at Park School.